it's Mark Laurie. It is July 15th. It's auto dialer time. It is also tax day. Can you believe it? It's tax day in July. A strange thing to say, but make sure you have your taxes in. And in the spirit of talking about the country, let's, re let's remind you that beginning in a week, the United States census takers will be at our lunch drop off, lunch pickup locations on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So if you haven't done so, please take an opportunity to complete your United States Census. It's important to the school district, it's important to the city of Niagara Falls. It will make us all better represented and hopefully drive money to where we need to have it here in the city. Uh, two cancellations if you're viewing this on Wednesday the 15th. The veggie van will not be at Kelpis tomorrow, which is a Thursday, and also this Friday there will be no free COVID testing at Niagara Falls High School as originally announced. Sorry for those two cancellations. Um, I want to remind everyone that you can still pick up a pre-K three or four application at a school, complete it, drop it off at central office. Please, we will not accept phone calls about the status of pre-K three and four um, applications. What we will do is use the United States mail to deliver a letter to you giving you information about what you need to do your child's placement in school, and that will help you. Those letters will come out next week. They'll be out next week. Uh, in terms of returning to school, the guidance is beginning to come in on uh, the return to school protocols. I do feel confident on July 15th, always subject to change, that we're going to be able to return to school in some form. What that will look like is still to be determined. Nothing has been officially decided. We continue to digest, plan, strategize how best to keep kids safe, protected, but return kids to where they need to be in September. And that's in our very good school buildings with teachers. Uh, one of the things that I know will be mandatory are face coverings or face masks, face shields. I'm getting multiple varieties of them. So please know that that is in the works um, and be patient with us as we roll things out. We will do YouTube videos again daily. We'll do auto dialers again daily when it's close to school. And for the staff uh, that needs a little bit more in-depth information, we will uh, go back to our Sunday evening webinars uh, very soon. So those are the announcements we have for today. I'd like to keep you updated. Remind you, hand washing with soap and water first, hand sanitizer secondarily. Face coverings, this is the new face covering of the day. It's, I don't wanna promote any a business, but it was an interesting face shield. It covers your face. That's the definition. Could be a mask type. It could be a gator type. Could be a shield. Uh, and remember to um, stay socially distant. Be positive. Call on somebody you haven't spoken to in a while. Uh, make their day. Pick up the phone. Send a text. Make an email. Uh, please, let's remain supportive and uh, good with each other. Thank you for your support of the district.